Hello. Just uh, resting here on this footbridge. Just looking down into the great somewhat beyond. Uh, sounds come into the body, um, but they don't all get considered by the, at least the conscious mind. Uh, they may get considered by the whole of the mind, but we're not aware of them all being considered. So when we hear something, um, we're usually kind of talking about the listening was a catalyst for thinking. And when we say we heard something, it's really that we have a thought about what was catalyzed by the sound come into the ears. You can see a turtle right below me, two turtles swimming, at least two. Maybe you can see them in the water swimming past. I don't have any idea if that came out. Turn around on the bridge in case they're swimming to this side. In which case, I'll try and give you another view. But that was pretty cool. Anyway, the uh, the listening isn't really uh, entirely just sound coming into the ears. It's really sound coming into the ears and being considered by the mind, uh, named, interpreted, responded or reacted to. So what I want to do is just try and uh, get a little bit of uh, sense about that process. I want to do that by taking the opportunity of uh, the sounds that do arrive um, and using the sounds that arrive as an opportunity to explore uh, where those sounds travel within me. In other words, I should be able to notice that they travel uh, into the mind. Uh, so this is a nice nature meditation if you can be outdoors where the sounds change. But I suppose you can be indoors with the variety of sounds that occur there. So, every sound uh, that comes to me, uh, you may be hearing a few already. Uh, a bird begins to chirp and there's a glurp, something pokes through the water surface. What I want to do is see if I can follow um, sort of the path of that sound to my mind. Uh, perhaps early into the situation where there's sound without yet understanding or naming. Far before reaction or response. 
every opportunity to do this is renewed with a new sound or one of the new sounds that arises. So, what sounds are there? For you? Where does the, where does the mind weave itself into the sound? Breathing, quieting the inner dialogue or monologue. In doing this, I may begin to recognize the reach of the mind or the distance of the mind. If those sounds travel to the mind or the sounds arrive at the ear and the mind rushes to the ear to um, do something with them. So just do that for a few more moments here with you. I have a renewed opportunity to follow the catalyst of sound, to maybe recognize a function of the mind or a bound of the mind or a place of the mind or perhaps just a facet of the mind. This is a nice one to do, uh, not with every sound that comes, just when one of the sound comes and you feel internally ready with that sound, give it a try. Okay. Thank you.